For the biomedical pathway, our first students that are interested in healthcare careers, biomedical technology careers, all the way from nurses, doctors, to microbiologists and nuclear medicine physicists. Take that tape flag, put it over the injury. Our introductory course is our Principles of Biomedical Science course. Um, from that course, you then transition to Human Body Systems or Anatomy and Physiology course, um, followed by Medical Interventions and then Biomedical Innovations, which ends up being our capstone course, where students then kind of showcase all the skills that they've learned. We have projects all the way from research to um, public service announcements um, to new interventions or enhanced interventions. Notice that there's eight types of fractures. In human body systems, it is just that. We look at the various human body systems. We basically just learn about like the human structure, like with, especially with the bones, how the body functions and how everything ties in together, basically. She basically had us look at a bunch of bones and she wants us to use the medical terms that she taught us instead of using like like common words. They were identifying those, not only those bones that they see, but then the types of fractures or injury that's occurring with that bone as well. I chose to take this class because I knew that I wanted to go into the medical field. It's interesting to learn about like our bodies and how they function. It makes me feel proud, um, especially when not only they go into the field, but they can maintain. We have a pretty good track record. We're seeing our students excel, and that makes me very proud.